Hello YouTube. And in particular, hello to the atheists, agnostics, and you, hard case. I watched your 30 minute video today. The one where you made some very valid points as to why you don't want to debate. And I'm not going to disagree with you, man. During the course of that debate, or the, well, <laughs> I guess it, it wasn't really a debate, because you were just stating your opinion, and you weren't going to be swayed, which, you know, fair enough. And I totally, totally can't blame you for that. But while you're wa I was watching that, I realized it was because of comments created by an agnostic against you. Now, I've been calling myself an agnostic for the 13 years. And I always felt that it was because there was always a possibility of something so I couldn't state an absolute belief and I thought this was the uh, most scientific route. You got me thinking, man. Now I know that you said you can't sway anyone. Well, you didn't sway me to believe one thing or another. So no credit. You don't have to take any credit for making me uh, believe something. Which, uh, knowing you, you're probably okay with. I've been taking stock recently. Especially since I started getting into the YouTube community. And viewing videos from the agnostics, Christians, and atheists. I don't believe in the Christian God. I don't believe in the Muslim God. I don't believe in any pagan gods or Hindu gods or reincarnation or Xenu or whatever. I'm done sitting on the fence. I'm now saying that I am an atheist. That's a big one for me. I was raised Mormon, stayed in the church until I was 19 years old, and I'm an atheist. You can call this my, uh, coming out. Well, I wanted to thank you, Hardcase, for really putting it bluntly, but not like an ass, to make me realize, you know, this is what I believe, and I should just admit it. And I li like the way you do your videos. I like how the, you don't bullshit. But because of the way you do your videos as opposed to other people like Mr. Keen there, when I watched you, I didn't feel like retching as I heard the arguments, and I can't ignore it anymore. I'm an atheist. I don't know how my family's going to take this, but it's a... I don't believe in God.
there is no God. There is nothing. This doesn't mean that if there is any scientific evidence given to me that something existed, if there was some sort of scientific evidence that there was something paranormal that you could not ignore. Well, that's one thing. But even Dawkins said that that's always a possibility. In the meantime, I'm just going to remain the way I am, an atheist. Well, fellow YouTube atheists, I'm here. True North out.